Hello guys, welcome to my channel Fun Times with Pruttay. Today I am back with another video and in this video we are going to see the working principle of ultrasonic sensors. So what is ultrasonic sensors we have to know. Ultrasonic sensors are those sensors which use ultrasonic waves to detect object or to measure the distance between itself and the object. So what are ultrasonic waves? Ultrasonic waves are those waves whose frequencies are beyond the normal hearing limit. It will be more than 20 kHz. Ultrasonic sensors have two transducers, one for transmitter and another for receiver and a control circuit. The transmitter of the module transmit ultrasonic sound of 40 kHz. This sound will be reflected back if an object present in front of it. The reflected sound wave is received by the receiver present in the module. The distance of the object can be calculated by measuring the travel time and the speed of the sound. So the distance is equal to time into speed of sound. Since the sound travel the same distance two times, so the distance is equal to time into speed divided by two. Speed of the ultrasonic sensor in air is 340 meter per second. We have to convert it in microsecond. So 340 into 10 to the power 2 centimeter per second which is equals to 0 0.0340 into 10 to the power 6 centimeter per second which is equals to 0 0.0340 centimeter per microsecond. We have to put the value here. D is equals to T into 0 0.0340 divided by 2 and to get the distance. The range of these sensors is 2 centimeter to 400 centimeter which is used in robotics, in pathfinding robots, obstacle detector etc. Four pins are present here as you can see. This is VCC pin. This pin used to power on the ultrasonic sensor. We have to connect it with Arduino Uno boards 5 volt pin. And this is the fourth pin you can see the ground pin. We have to connect it with Arduino Uno boards ground pin. This is the second pin of this ultrasonic sensor. This is trigger pin. You have to give the short 10 microsecond pulse to this pin to start the ranging. After that, the module emits the ultrasonic waves. At the same time, the module makes the echo pin high. That is our third pin. The wave are reflected by the object and the wave absorbed by the receiver. This echo pin goes low. So guys, that's it for today. If you like this video, hit the like button and subscribe my channel. Thank you.